Whatever is bothering you, whatever is disturbing you, whatever is, is causing you a sense of turmoil or conflict, the depth of the teaching is that you do want it. So what, where does that leave us? Where does that take us? Is Jesus is saying, the first thing you need to really do in authentic spiritual awakening is you need to start to honor the power of your wanting. If you, if you keep pushing that power of the wanting out of, out of mind, oh, then it's easy to play victim. Oh, then it's easy to play I'm at the mercy of something outside of me. But, but you would have first to deny the power of your wanting before you could play those games of the ego. You made the ego by believing in it. And you can dispel the ego by withdrawing your belief from it. Isn't that powerful? He's not saying fight the ego. He's not saying destroy the ego. He's saying you can dispel it by withdrawing your belief from it. You've got the power all along. That's what Glenda the Good Witch told Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz. <laughs> you always had the power to go home. We've always had the power. 